The windbags used to be all right. Then the calamity took the floor out from under him. Kid does it again. Only fair he decides what we build next. A lot of things need fixing up in this world, and we can start right here. Kid's lifelong friends looking fit to keep on fighting. Little Zolwood oil and that blade shines like a light. Squirt cider will toughen you right up. Too bad about the musty aftertaste. Picked up traces of other cores while the kid was out. Couples used to walk the sundown path. The kid ain't here for pleasure though. Somebody gets to the core before the kid. The floor starts giving way under the lightest step. The single panic squirt could bring the whole place down. So could a reckless kid for that matter. Fragments of the old world rain from the sky. See, the path was intended for leisurely strolling and such. Not so much for noise and tomfoolery. Travel always was an iffy proposition. The calamity changed everything, even where the wind blows. Well, if we mastered the winds in the old days, we can do it again. But the question is... Who 
else could have taken the core? Well, ain't no survivor stole the thing. Scumbag ate it by mistake. Tough break. Unlike the kid, that core ain't coming back. live munitions down the path. Find time to find them. Gas fellas need some shut eye from time to time. They get real cranky when you wake them up. toil, Kid keeps coming back to an overwhelming question. Who else could have survived the calamity? So he didn't find the core that time, but that ain't about to stop us. <laughs> 